Hello and welcome back to the happiest place on earth. Today we're playing our dragon deck again, but this time we've added Salamence to the lineup. Alright, um, let's see, do I want to start with this? I think our opponent's going first, right? Let's double check here. Do 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 do. Okay, yeah, okay, if our opponent's going first, I want Jibble into Gabite. Giblet head. Wow, five mulligans. Christ almighty. Okay. Okay. Do you like my ugly deck box? Yeah, I'll draw five cards. Coughing. So, wheezing might be a little thorn in our side. Okay, air bud. I'm trying to think of the quickest way we can blast. Blast this thing. This is really strong, obviously. Is it capture energy? Yeah. It's a good card. I'm trying to think of uh, what we do, even if we had double dragon energy. Let's take a look first for our basics. Okay, Gabite's in the deck. Dragonite lines in the deck. Looks like all of our dragons are here. You know what? This deals with wheezing on the spot. We have Berserk. They'll never see it coming. I should have checked to see if I had my double dragon though. I do. Okay, okay. That's great. We're just going to go full ballistic here. Unrelenting aggression, right? And then they'll never have their wheezing again. Seems good. If we access our rainbow energy somehow, then this will just get cranked up to, you know, 130. Is it 130? 160. Okay. 160 is better than 130. Chorus for 5. I think next turn we get good bite and just go up into Dragonair. Sure. So we need to be wary of this guy. Okay. Just kidding. Just, just hard draw the Dragonair. I think I want to set this up. Well, this is pretty good because if Guzzlord comes down and just pops Drampa, then we can uh, just counterattack. Yeah, this is 160. Cool. Uh, most of our guys attack with water, so water is like the bridge. So I don't think I really care for this. So if they knock this out with uh, Guzzlord, then I'm going to be punished by um, Raihan plus Drudigan. This deck is psycho. No way, Vern. Okay. I was worried about Beast Ring. Sure. That doesn't really bother me because this just goes in a Dragonite. Oh. Or or you just hard draw the Dragonite, right? Um, I think this might go into Sh uh, Baggins now. Bilbo Baggins. Um, yeah. Sure. That's pretty good. Let's 
I'm trying to think of what this is gonna do. It's just poking for seventy, like a like a like a caveman. I was stuttering because there's no words for it. Is Salamence even the move? Salamence has a nice effect, but they have no bench Pokemon. Uh, I guess I need to set up for it. Why is Adamant in this deck? You tell me. Thinking. What is the strongest unit we can get? That seems fine. Let's draw three cards. That's pretty sweet. Do I want to recycle any of these? No, not really. Unfortunately, I have no way to damage my stuff right now. Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The good old Berserk for 70. We should BM and Corkscrew Punch it for 30. Just exact knockout. Sure. Oh, dude, they just walked into this Drampa. Never mind. I thought they were going to just smack something on the bench. We're not that lucky, are we? Sure. Are they going to knock this out? Heavy ball. That's hilarious, considering uh, where we put this wheezing. Or coughing, I'm sorry. Okay. Why do they put the float stone here, dude? Seriously. If you knew you only need one more energy attack, why would you? Why would you? Okay. Luckily for opponent, I have no out to this immediately. Like, in one fell swoop. I feel like this is still the problem, right? Let's, uh, let's look through our deck, see what we can do. We have your boy Guzma. I actually like the Marnie. They have too many cards. Only I am allowed to have fun. Then we have Gabite access. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Hello. Yeah, I'm pretty positive that's what I want. Uh, put a fire here. Now just do it here. Here's fine. This guy attacks much quicker. I don't think I want to blast this. We're going to do the BM Corkscrew Punch for 30 damage. The tried and true classic. Town map, okay. Yeah, I really don't care if this retreats into that. This is uh, not good for our opponent. This thing slams for 160. So I feel like this is going to retreat into that. Oh, there's the Beast Ring. That uh, doesn't really bother me too much, considering we have Dragonite. Sure. The damage has been done. 
so what we just need is a way to get our water energy uh, this is probably the safest way to do it because they shuffled in uh, our blend energy I think that's what it's called it's the one that provides four we sell rainbow energy okay take your two prizes saw that from 10 miles away Here's where the dragon deck just, you know, goes ape. Do we want to stretch or anybody? No. I feel like this game's going to close out before this uh, becomes relevant. So I'm considering discarding candy stretcher. Well, there's only one fighting energy here. Well, candy's got to go for sure. Sure. That is called blend energy. Let's get that. Um, okay. The Bing Bong helmet. Dude, this deck is just something. Like, how is this legal? Yeah, okay. Okay, game. Go, Mr. Bing Bong. Jesus. Ooh, that's, uh, that's good. Sure. It's a good lock piece. Obviously, we want to resolve all of our effects first. This guy, just, just, just sitting here since turn one. Excuse me? Be productive. Be a team player. Okay. Yeah, this card is not as good in this format, in my opinion. Sure. What is this doing then? 20 damage. 20 damage. You need some Pokemon or you're going to get donked. Do not make me Dragon Claw you. Mr. Bing Bong's gonna take 30 less damage from attacks. Okay, hammer in, huh? You're dead. Do you think I can't rip the next energy? It's hilarious. What's the most expedient way to find my last energy? How about we thin down the deck? That's step one, right? Yeah, we have five energies. What is the quickest way to draw? How about we just increase the odds? Six energies. Six out of uh, 22 cards. Slight lag there. I don't know why. Alright, alright. Will you draw me one of those six cards. Now I do not want to switch. We did it. BM town map. And play that. And Mr. Bing Bong. Awesome. Two Pokemon do the job. Jeez, look at that. 520. Blaze it! Welcome back. Rematching my opponent. Letting him go first as a courtesy, even though I won the flip. Which is fine. 
Uh, this hand could use a reset. All right. This is not where you want to have this. I mean, we got lucky last game. Um, yup, just to turn one pop. I don't think the Mulligan of five, you know, really helped that because we had the Guzma Hall in the nest ball, anyways. But still, it was just nice. Very, very aggro. Nice. Uh, let's see. To be honest. I don't foresee playing any of these other than the Marnie. Okay. It's far this heavy ball. Ooh, giblet head. Okay. We can get this out of the way, that'd be great. We have end next turn, which is not bad. Uh, so ideally, we have float stone, double dragon energy, and blast this wheezing in one go. This hits for 160, wheezing has 130 HP. Here we go. Oh. Well, we still do 160 exacts. Sure. Seems good. This is good, but not now. That is the key issue here, because of this wheezing. Feels bad giving our opponent two cards, but you gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, Lysander is okay. I think we're getting Drudigan. Drudigan seems fine. Okay, so our hand here is a little gridlocked. Say I move this out of the way, right? We're still not doing anything. Sure. Alright, this game could be bad for us. It's not all fun and games when you're playing the dragon deck. Sure. Kind of sucks that this might die, but uh, it is what it is. The rough part is this is going to die on our turn if they just use this if you're poison. Four during their end step, four during our end step, so this makes this very awkward. Sure. This might get awkward. Our hand's just flooded with stuff that we can't use. It's almost like we have to force this wheezing out of the way using Lysander. And then just draw on a one to two cards. Not the business. They wasted their uh, energy here on on this Zigzagoon. So they don't have many ways to move this out of the way. They would need Floatstone exactly. Opponent in the think tank, escape rope, sure. Um, Trying to think. Uh, you can take one for the team. That's actually preferred. Yeah, they're just retreating to the wheezing, I feel. Okay. This was not doing us any favors. Quick ball. Okay, quick ball is decent in regards to the fact that it burns down a card from our hand. I am down for it. Uh, Jesus. Jesus. This is the way. Yeah. 
Yeah. I'm putting this here because it only takes a water to retreat it. And in order to do that, we'll have to move this out of the way first. So if we Lysander, play Water Energy, retreat this, we can go into Reggie Drago and hopefully peel some cards. That's my mindset here. Yeah, these dummies ain't doing much. Also, if it's poisoned, if we were able to just move it out, you know, it'll, it'll, it'll buy it some time. Oh, jeez. 20 damage. Look at that. Sure. Give me water energy, please. Yikes. That's awkward. Give me just pass. This thing's just gonna die. I need this Lysander to move this. <laughs> we need to be careful about when we throw this in. Fine. I've given them enough, you know, draw steps trying to move my stuff out of the way. Yeah, what sucks is when we, uh, Lysander. It's just, uh, we need to be very cautious about what we think we can just knock out. Get through all the energies here. Okay. That changes a lot. Hopefully by the better, but we need to get rid of this. Sure. Can we rip double dragon? The problem is these come down. Float stone. Let's play those. Wow, not much value. Level ball can evolve one of these. Yeah, this guy's just stuck here now. Try to think. We have the path. Yeah, awkwardly, these, are, these won't proc under the poison, most likely. Because this is going to die on our turn. Oh, this is awkward. Okay, the, the Guzzlord primed. Sure, I guess. Sure. Seems good. Here's, here's a story. If we deal Reggie Drago into Guzzlord, Moltres deals with Reggie Drago. Garchomp can deal with both. We have teammates. Let me think. I think this is the safest move.
Then we just want this. Yeah, I guess. It's dragon coal. Let's start with this, right? It's for our teammates. I'm trying to think. We have like no card advantage engines. I think N is probably one of the strongest things we can do right now. We'll see how mistaken I am. Well, town map also gets the counter energy if they somehow bypass this guard chomp. That might be a little greedy. Thinking, thinking, thinking. I think I just want to grab uh, the VS Eager. Okay. Seems all right. Millicent to Caitlin and the uh, Noivern. So Garchomp's gonna mow some people. Um, if we mow down one more Pokemon, Moltres will eat this Garchomp. So we need to be very mindful of that. Yeah, we don't have any uh, items or tools that'll just prevent some damage. It's already gone. Sororc. Seems good. Nothing to imitate. So, what do they send in? I think the smartest thing is to send in this, right? Oh no. That's not good. Jesus. I think how much value we got this Red D Drago. We have the float stone, so I'm not really concerned. Stormy. Uh, let's see. Counter energy is out of the question. Yeah, I think we have to attack with Garchomp. And the mole just kills us. Yeah, that Muldrez has pinned us. Oh man, I wish we had a Lysander and... That would have been like the best move. Uh, shoot, yeah, this thing just applies a bunch of pressure. Can we just concede? I'm okay with that. Let's go on to game three. Alright, welcome back. On the flip, let's go first. The last game was rough. 
Okay, this is pretty good. Um, hmm. Yeah, Lance is very insane. I think we're going to start setting up all of our Pokemon. Um, Salamence line's there. That's there. This one. I think I'm going to Lance, get the evolutions for these, and then use uh, Jibble to get, you know, Bilbo Baggins. Alternatively, we can just use Mahala. Get Flowstone, Double Dragon Energy, and bop this coughing. That is a choice. Okay. Well, I feel like it's going to evolve by the time I try to do that. Well, let's see. We can still Oko it. Yeah. As long as double dragon energies in the deck. And flowstone. Sure. Seems good. Bane of our existence, the Moltres. Sure. They have expended all their darks. Stick to the plan. How about we never see that thing again? It's like a repeat of game one. 160. Well, it's better than a repeat. Yeah, this thing's uh, gonna go to town. I think we're gonna Lance next turn. Sure. The Flowstone already did its job, and same with the Lost City. We wanted this going. Seems terrible for our opponent. Bilbo Baggins. Yeah, this is uh, going to be catastrophic. Just gonna get evolutions. We have Stormy Mountain to get um a basic. You are a quality basic. Okay, seems good. That's actually super good. Um, we need to start setting up other attackers. Uh, I don't think I want to evolve this yet. But, uh, it's a beat stick. Too bad I don't give a dang. I will not let that Moltres stop me again. Click, 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 click. Opponent concedes. Alright, we got our revenge. Sweet. Sweet. 